When Maria Connell comes to work every day, it's to make a difference in the lives of students. She's been here at Conyeria Catholic School for the last 17 years working as a kindergarten aide for Mrs. Colvin's kindergarten classroom. This is where she went to grade school before graduating from high school. Let's go meet Maria. Well, Miss Connell, as your students call you, what are some of the things that you like best about working here at Con Area with the students? It's a, it's a Catholic, because it's a Catholic school. They talk a lot about God, and I, I, I feel like that I, I like to pass down my faith, so they can learn more about my faith and what I am about and what I do of them. Very good, very good. And what are some of the things that you do do? Um, what are some of your duties here at the school? Well, I do some time today. I oh, you don't want that the morning stuff or just want the afternoon? Oh, everything, whatever you mm. do. What are some of your, your duties? Well, I'm in. I usually, um, well, I, I'll do clean up their toys. Yes. So sometimes there's a bit of, a lot of toys. Yes. And, uh, and when they have special classes, like gym, they don't always have time to clean up, they have to line up, right. and they do those classes, and I go with them. So I just help the best I can, and oh, they always come to me, and when, when they don't know where they go, but they're getting a lot better at that, that's, I think. That's good, and I'm glad you brought that up. So you help the kids wherever they are, whether they're in class or gym or even at lunch. Yes. You assist them. Yes. And when, especially when they're new, um, coming into the uh, new year. Yeah. Wow, what's that like for, for, a, for a new kindergarten? And what do you try to do to make them feel more comfortable? I just, I, I talk with them. I try to make them feel better. I like to know about their name. Well, I'm there if they need help. Okay. If they need anything, I'm right. always there. They, they always come to me. Do they? Oh, yeah. With what kind of things do they come to you with? Like, Maria, can you put my water in my um, container? Okay. Um, what else? Um, I need help with this paper. Sometimes I help. Yes. Then Miss Gordon comes in. Yes. Make sure. Very good. Very good. So Mrs. Colvin is the kindergarten teacher, and, yeah. uh, and you've been here for a long time, too, as well. Yeah. So this is like your second home and, and your second family as well, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's like a family. Very yes. good. Very good. You graduated from Geibel. You worked at Walmart a little bit. A little and, bit. Yes. And then you got a phone call. From In the, the summertime. Yeah, from, this, from the principal of Con Area. What did she say? What was that all about? Well, um, that's... That she talked to with Mrs. Garvin. Yes. And it, it was the day that I was getting ready to, to go on vacation, actually. Okay, you were going on vacation. Okay. Yeah. Um, and she asked me to, to, if I wanted to work in kindergarten. Wonderful. And I said yes. Wonderful. So, so you were invited by the principal to, to work here? Yes. That's wonderful. And Mrs. Garvin. Was that a tough decision? Did you have to think about that? I think that this is a better job than what I had before. Mm -hmm. I'm with the kids, I'm involved with them, yes. I do a lot of stuff with the kids. They're like your kids, aren't they? Like my kids, That's yes. right, that's awesome. So Maria, you write poetry. It's one of the things that you do. It's one of your gifts, and you write poetry for family and friends, for special occasions, uh, yeah. to really inspire. Um, people and, and to celebrate um, their victories and the things that are happening in their lives. Yeah. I understand you also write some um, poetry and you have for Con Area and its students. Would you mind sharing a little bit with us? Yes. Let's go in a circle and, and, and hear it. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Last day of school, so it's old. Last day of school, Miss Garvin's kindergarten class. I just love helping all of you every day and seeing all of you smiles on your face and, and talking with you and, and, and hearing about your day. 
stories from you is the best part of my day. I am so proud that you are going to first grade and you are really growing up into wonderful boys and girls. May God bless you. I love all of you. I love all of you. Maria. I was born and raised in Mount Pleasant and lived there all my life. I started working for Armstrong in February of 1973. I joined the fire department in November of 1976. Being a volunteer means to help people, and I guess I've always grown up knowing that helping people was the main thing. Armstrong has always been community-oriented. They've always taken care of people that came from the community. Even though I'm getting older, I still enjoy going out and helping whenever I can. Being able to help somebody when they're in need it makes you feel real good inside. So what I'd like to be able to ask um, you all is a little bit about Miss Connell and what she means to you. How does she help you? What difference does she make in your life every day? And um, what nice things you can say about Miss Connell that how she impacts your day. Could you do that? We have with us Connell. His name happens to be Connell, like Miss Connell, and Jet. Connell, what do you like about Miss Connell? How is she special to you? She helps us. She helps us open stuff when we can't open it. We open things like, like milk cartons and things like that? Yes, that's good. Nice to have a helper. And Jet, how about you? What does Miss Connell do to help you? She helps, like, she helps me clean me, help the put stuff way up high if it's there. Very good. So when things are up high, she helps get it up there for you. Nice. Thank you. Maria helps us clean up. Clean up what kind of things? Our toys. Ah, oh, very good. Okay, Helena, what does Miss Connell do for you? Like, she helps us check our folders. Check your folders. So for homework and things like that? Yeah. Ah, oh, very nice. Make sure you have everything in it to take home? Yeah. Nice. So, Anna, what does Miss Connell do to help you? Um, she, um... She, like, like, when I put stuff out, I try to tell her, please don't put that thing away because I'm playing with it. And she forgets a little, but I say that's okay. Okay, very good. So she's really taking good care of cleaning up. Yeah, but, I, but if she, she did it and I said, that's okay, I'll get it back out again. Oh, that's nice. You work together with that, don't you? Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Thank you for sharing. Yeah. Maria helps us fill, Maria fills our water bottles up when they're empty. Does she? That's good. Yeah. Do you have water bottles at lunchtime? When do you have water bottles here at the school? Um, well, we put them over there. Ah, oh, during the day. Mm -hmm. Nice. So you can always have water available mm -hmm. to you. Nice. Thank you. Thank you're you for welcome. sharing that. This is Grayson. Grayson. How does Miss Connell help you on the playground? Um, she pushes us on the playground. Nice. Hi, Ella. Hi. Hi. So tell me, how does Miss Connell help you? When we're in lunch and we have to go to the bathroom, she takes us. She takes you, and when you're at lunch, to the bathroom. She walks you there. Wonderful. So you can get there safely and back. Wonderful. Thanks so much. What's your name? Amaya. Amaya. How does Miss Connell help you? Whenever I want a baby, she helps me get it down. A baby doll? That's very nice. It is up high, and she reaches up there and gets it for you. It means a lot to you, doesn't it? Very good. All right, thank you so much. All right, this is Seal Solon, principal of Con Area Catholic School. Seal, what does it mean to you to have Maria as part of the Con Area family? Maria is a very important part of our Con Area family. Uh, not only does she help the kids a lot with what they need, but she also brings to our school community a very spiritual attitude, which fits in so nicely with our school's mission and philosophy. She just is truly a uh, faith-filled person, so we love having her. Thank you, Miss Connell. Thank you. <laughs> Wow. Thank you.
<laughs> oh, that's cute. At Con Area Catholic School, where a full spectrum of academics, faith, technology, and programs are enriching the lives of students, so is Maria Connell. She really inspires us to become who we were meant to be, to live our purpose, and to be extraordinary. Thanks so much for being with us.